Hi there, Gemini. Thanks so much for tuning in. I'm Astro Girl looking at May 16th through the 22nd. And happy birthday to those Geminis celebrating this weekend. Yes, the sun is moving into your sign. It's your time to shine, but not before Mercury, your ruler, finally moves direct. It's been out of phase since April 28, causing all sorts of problems, as you probably are well aware of. And it moves forward on the 21st. Perfect timing because then the sun moves into your sign. And on Sunday, we actually have a full moon in Sagittarius. Sagittarius being your opposite sign, your seventh house of one on one relationships and partnerships, how you deal with people one on one. So if you've been having some sort of struggle with someone or if you've been out of sync with someone thanks to Mercury being out of phase, this is a time with that full moon when you'll be able to see the forest for the trees and you'll be able to sit down or talk it out with the person that you feel you're not getting along with or not vibing with and work out how you can get along and if this uh, situation is fixable because sometimes all you need to do is just talk about it, laugh about it, and move on. Other times, of course, it's a bit more serious. So let's hope it's the former for you. The sun moves into Gemini, your sign, a cerebral sign that highlights sibling sales and social media. That's the uh, kind of things that your sign uh, rules. The first contact of the newly minted Gemini Sun is on Saturday, May 21st, with of course the Sagittarius full moon. Mars, Mars, the planet of energy, also plays a big role in this full moon because it's merged together with the moon and in opposition to the Gemini Sun. Ordinarily, when the moon and Mars gang up on the sun, it could mean war. But Mars, of course, is out of phase in Sagittarius. And most of the antagonistic behavior will be internalized. Because the full moon is a time of completion and Sagittarius often refers to foreign places, there's hope that this alignment could be a sign of a peace accord or at least a cessation of overseas conflict. It's time to start looking ahead again Sunday, May 22nd, with Mercury finally moving direct. This positive change of direction is a get up and go signal for communications, social media, electronics and travel. So for those of you who've been putting off travel or anything or buying a new computer or a car or a TV or anything like that, you can rest assured that in a couple of days. I always give it a couple of days because I feel like sometimes Mercury sort of hangs around and, 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 and shifts between retrograde and forward. So I'd give it to like next Wednesday when you really feel like you've got the all clear. Sometimes you all almost feel it that Mercury has moved direct. And then just start on, go about my business. And, and have a wonderful, wonderful time doing it. And as I said, it's your time to shine. Thanks so much and I'll speak to you again next week.